And finally, today we head to Gastonia, North Carolina, where some mysterious photographs have captured the attention of a community and a nation. If you've been on Facebook in the last week, there is a good chance you have seen these pictures. A cloaked figure supposedly standing outside an apartment complex in Gastonia and dropping raw meat. Dropping raw meat sounds like a weird sex thing I don't want to know about. What is the pleasure in using raw meat anally? Yeah. Who is this guy who's been walking around in a dark cloak leaving raw meat on the playground? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> what? Quit your yuck yucking news, people. We're going to take this story about a man wearing a cloak dropping raw meat on the ground seriously. Dark, mysterious, unexplained. This image has been the talk of the town this week. I think somebody's like trying to summon Satan or something. Yes. If there's one thing we all know about Satan, it's that he loves the f out of raw meat. Those are some great pork chops, Satan. Yeah. And playgrounds, specifically raw meat on playgrounds. The cloaked figure had dropped raw meat near this playground. So what's everyone else in the neighborhood think about this cloaked raw meat dropping playground playing Satan worshiping degenerate? Yo, they need to stay away from my kids, stay away from this neighborhood. Who goes around in 90 degree weather with a black hood on? That is a great question. And you might be surprised to hear this, but this cloaked psycho isn't alone. Creepy, bizarre, his presence literally stops people in their tracks. There is a place where sleepers sleep and dreamers dream. Well, Crystal, he calls himself the Light Wanderer, traveling to that southwest Albuquerque cemetery to pray for the dead. Okay, so other than totally fat Jewing the Light Wanderer's cloak psycho shtick, anything else we should know about the raw meat reaper? Many believing the photo was taken in this Gastonia apartment complex. I was like, oh wait, that's my neighborhood. And it's true. A director for the apartment's realty company confirming today that the photo was taken here, but that it's just a student acting like a TV character for a school project. Oh, so it's just a student acting like a TV character for a student film. <laughs> that makes sense. No, it doesn't. What TV character wears a cloak and drops raw meat all over playgrounds? Coming this fall to NBC. He's a cloak wearing Satan worshiper who loves playgrounds and raw meat. Smart car? I thought you said tartar. <laughs> and he's a cloak wearing cemetery doomsayer with a penchant for poetry. There's nothing to be afraid of except those that seek to cause harm, pain, destruction. But this fall on NBC, they're roommates. It's reaping ain't easy. This fall on NBC, where comedy goes to die. Well, now that we know this specific cloak wearing weirdo is just a kid with a YouTube account, life has gone back to normal in Gastonia. But nevertheless, Gastonia PD is still encouraging everyone to be on high alert. If anybody sees anything suspicious, please call us, you know, and we can go check it out. LeBaron. Hey, sir. Hello, you got a question. Uh, yes, I do. You want to insert meat, uh, raw meat or cooked? Raw meat? Yeah, in, into each other's rectum. Yeah. Once again, I'm Mike Rylander. Thanks for watching. You can watch full episodes of our show at SoThatHappened.tv. You can like us on Facebook. You can follow us on Twitter. And you can stop putting raw meat in your ass. What the f***?